What's going on everyone? Thank you so much for clicking on the video. And today, we're gonna be taking a look at the Hyperkin Travel Bag for the Nintendo Switch. So this sleek little travel accessory for your Nintendo Switch is actually made by Hyperkin. And Hyperkin is known for making some quite, quite good accessories for video games and I've always been a really big fan of theirs and so when I went out and bought this I, I went out and bought this one I didn't it wasn't actually provided to me by then uh, I bought it off Amazon and I'll have a link in the video description uh, if you're interested in finding out more about it or if you'd like to pick one up as well um, but when I got this I was really just kind of disappointed with it because first of all uh, you'll find out quickly once we start putting the stuff in it that it doesn't have as much room as I would have liked I do like the strap that it has, it's kind of elastic um, and it seems like it's pretty good quality in itself. I don't like that the clips are plastic and I don't know if you've had any experience with like travel bags like this but when they have plastic clips they get kind of squeaky when you walk and this got squeaky immediately. So if that's going to bother you this is definitely a noisy bag and it, and it squeaks. Luckily it does have a one year warranty, it says that right on the box because you'll probably end up using it right away. Uh, mine actually broke during the review, but I was able to fix it, the zipper got unhooked. So let's crack her open, and you can see that the zipper, it goes all around like this. You can see that as we open it, there is a nice padded pocket where your switch goes. And I like this pocket a lot more than some of the other pockets that I've seen, especially on the Elite Player Backpack because even though there's a lot uh, more room in the Elite Player backpack, the pockets in the backpack aren't quite as secure or padded as these are. So let's go ahead and throw the switch in there and I'll show you exactly what that looks like. And it fits right in and it's nice and padded. These are really thick pockets. The Velcro easily slides right over and the switch gets fully, fully covered up. There aren't any problems at all. And right next to that sits another pocket right on top for your dock and you can just throw that in there much easier than the backpack. Um, and it's, as well, each pocket is padded just the same. The Velcro goes right over. You can see that it takes care of it quite nicely. I'm, I'm, I'm impressed with the pockets. I like the quality of the pockets. But we're gonna go ahead and move on to the Pro Controller and throw this guy in there. So you can see that it does fit nicely. It has like a little sling. Uh, there's no designated really items for each one of these pockets. You can kind of put whatever you want in there. So I just like this little sling area for the Pro Controller. But it does also have room for the AC adapter and the HDMI cable and probably a few more small things, maybe a battery pack if you want to play it portably. Definitely more room for cables. However, like you're not going to be able to put a laptop in this thing at all. So, you know, I wouldn't want to put that in there like this and have it hanging out or getting scratched up on the back of my bag. It just wouldn't work well at all. This is made mainly for your Switch and only your Switch gear. And it's quite a large bag as well. So you're not gonna be able to kind of put a water bottle in this or like your books or anything like that. This is this is basically just for your Switch. Um, but let's just go over the last pocket real quick. It's a very basic whatever pocket. You could just throw anything in there, some keys or papers or plane tickets, whatever you have that you don't want to keep in your pockets. So that's the Hyperkin travel bag for the Nintendo Switch. Personally guys, just, you know, friend to friend, uh, Imano Imano, compadre to compadre. <laughs> My honest opinion about it, I would not recommend you guys pick this thing up. Um, I'm quite disappointed in Hyperkin's execution with their travel bag for the Nintendo Switch. I really, really think that they could have done a better job. And I can't wait to see what other future accessories they have for the Nintendo Switch. I'm really excited to test those out as well. But for the time being, I think you guys should definitely skip this one. If you're looking for a better travel bag, I would definitely check out the Elite Player Backpack first if you need more room other than your Switch stuff. Or if you just want to transport your Switch setup itself and you don't need any additional space but you still want good protection, I would look at the RDS Industries case. I also made a video about both of those cases and I'll have links to those in the description as well. But before you go, let's talk about that Switch giveaway. 
I'm going to be giving away a free Nintendo Switch to one of my subscribers as soon as this channel gets to 20,000 subscribers. All you have to do to enter into the giveaway is click on the Gleam link in the video description below. So that's going to be the end of the video, guys. If you enjoyed it, please remember to like it and subscribe for the giveaway and subscribe for more Switch videos just like this one. Thanks, and have a great day.